I want to talk about mutation, which is claimed as the base of evolution theory. There has been several definitions of mutation, but we can say that mutations are like poisons. As you know, drinking poison does not have a beneficial effect on you. What's more, some kind of poisons may kill a crowded village. Mutation is a powerful poison, and a man who is exposed to a mutation will be damaged in any case. Mutations break, destroy, and disintegrate DNA. Imagine that someone draw close to you and say that he will flick away your antique masterpiece waist and its value will increase if it breaks down. You will feel pity for this person and his ridiculous idea. Please, don't believe in those people who say that your broken DNA will improve your skills. Human body is a perfect machine which needs to have a perfect copy of DNA in its each cell. The DNA's creation is so amazing that, besides evolution, just one missing letter of DNA may cause death. What's more, you don't need to force yourself to see the effects of mutations. There are countless examples of handicapped or deaf people who were exposed to mutation. We can consider it over an example. DNA is a library consisting of 1,000 books, and all these books contain 3 billion base pairs. You can think, what in the world may happen if some of these letters would be missing? Believe me, so much things may happen. Cells may not survive without oxygen. As we breathe, we take oxygen from the air, and our red blood cells carry these oxygen molecules to our body parts and our cells produce energy by using this oxygen. What would happen if one day our blood cells decide not to carry oxygen to our body? There is an illness called sickle cell anemia. In this illness, red blood cells cannot carry oxygen to the body. This is an hereditary illness and arises at the age of school children. And if a child has this illness, he has to learn to live with it all his life long. Let's see what happens. Bones, spleen, lungs, kidney and brain are damaged. It causes irresistible pain and crisis. And the deficiency of oxygen in brain may cause death or stroke. And for today's technology, the only cure is to have blood transfusion. But it's not the end. Also patients should have pills or injections for 10 or 12 hours in five nights of a week to prevent themselves from the side effect of blood transfusion. Sickle cell anemia occurs when just one letter in DNA is replaced by another. As I said before, there are three billion base pairs in DNA and each of them is very, very important for us. There are lots of mutations which cause irreversible damages and fatal results. Scientists are working days and nights to cure the illnesses. It is obvious that mutation, which has a fatal effect on living things, cannot be claimed as a useful cause. However, you should think deeply now. Why should someone show a fatality as a beneficial ground? Evolution theory is not an ordinary theory. It is a lie, which spreads the materialistic thought through people. Look around you and want them to show you just one fossil proving evolution. They cannot. Want them to show you just one half bird, half fish fossil or half human, half monkey fossil. They cannot, because there is no evolution. And each fossil is protesting evolution. There is just one question left which needs to be answered immediately. Do you want to be poisoned? You can write to me from mutationisapoison at gmail.com address. Have a nice day.